What's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Bugs, back. And yes, guys, today, all my subscribers, some people that follow me is, uh, my brother is texting me. I'm sorry. Some people that are subscribed to me was asking, like, some of them are noobs, I guess you could say. So they wanted a way, they wanted, um, they wanted a way to work the auction. So I'm going to make a video on how you guys use the auction as starters. Okay, guys? So... Let's get into this. It's going to be a nice long video. It's not going to be short. I'm going to show you guys exactly what to do. Okay. So right now, I'm going to give an overview of the auction. Right now, everything is so cheap. And you could just tell, why is the some of the best cars in the game? Like, for instance, Corey Kluber is 20-something K. There's no way these prices stick. It's just because every single person in the game has packs and free diamonds once that's gone in like a week i would say everyone goes up mad so right now okay so ready the buy now right is what you could buy but this sell now is people going like this create buy order you have to have stubs to do this okay so let's say i want to place do you see the sell now people could just quick sell out that price fast so right now i could create a buy order let's just say for 18666 ready Look, now mine's the mine is the fastest way people could quick sell. Mine's on top. I overcut this guy for 1866. So now I'm going to make I could make easy profit like that, okay? Like after that trash pack opening I just did, I'm going to need some profit back. So yeah, I'm definitely going to need some profit back after those trash packs. So yeah. So I'm going to I don't want to do that Elangoria though. But you see what I'm saying? So if I if I if someone sold that, if someone quick sold that card I'll put it up for the buy now price of twenty nine eight. Let's say twenty nine eight hundred. Hopefully, make stubs. I'll make like two k stubs. Okay. So that's pretty much the basic way you use the auction. And oh my god, wait up! I oh that I knew that was coming. Okay, so ready, guys? I bought that Chris sale for very cheap. Okay, he's in my squad. My squad is stacked, as you can see. It's just it's dirty as hell. It's just it's beautiful. This squad. Okay. So ready, look at my picture. I got Kluber down here, okay? He has no buy now, which is very interesting. I'm going to try selling him up. I'm going to put him up for like 40K or something. Dude, because, okay, I bought him for 20K. He's an 88 overall pitcher. He's good at. He's good in real life. He's like an ace. He's, he's the ace of all. He's one of the top five pitchers in the MLB, okay? So I'm going to put him up. I don't know if they're going to let me, but I'm going to put him up for 45K. Yeah, like, I don't know what the range is. That's the only problem. It says that there's a range, but what's the range? Because that makes no sense whatsoever. So these sell nows, they're screwing up. They're screwing up his auction right now. It's really destroying it. And look, guys. So ready? Okay. So what you want to do? I'm gonna tell you how to make stubs as well in this video. What you want to do, honestly, pay attention to this equipment. Like this glove right here, for 14k, I would place a buy now, right now, for 15k. People are gonna do it because people don't want to wait to sell equipment. So, like, right now, how to make mad stubs and, like, how to learn the auction. Pay attention to the equipment, guys. The equipment, you make mad stubs off. I already made mad stubs off the equipment. As you can see, look at all these guys I sold over here. I sold all this equipment and stuff for so cheap. But not for cheap. What am I saying? For mad profit. I sold all this equipment. I've been doing it for a really long time. I've been doing this since last year. I'm going to be the show. You want to sell a lot of equipment. This guy actually is a buy now of one mil, which is insane. Don't ask me how, but right now, what what my predictions are for the auction right now, really what's going to happen is everyone's going to go up, guys. It's going to happen. Like, it just it has to go up. How can they? Oh, my God. Andrew Jones. This guy is so G. He was so good, yo. Oh, my God. All right. So, what's, what I'm going to say why do I feel like everything is going to go up in price? Because the auction, think about it. Why would diamond cards, like t some of the top cards in the game go for 20K? It just, it doesn't make any logical sense to me. Like, it really doesn't. Like, the Grom is a Cy Young 39K. I just, I don't get it. The, like, it's really just, this, they're not going to be this cheap. All these diamond cards, like, look, I got Josh Hader out of a pack. He's already 21K. It makes no sense. He's the best relief pitcher in the game. So, like, how? Like, it just doesn't make sense at all. Like, okay. So, 
Every guys, honestly, guys, you could buy a team. I, not golds. Golds are probably gonna keep going down, unless they're eighty four or eighty five or whatever. They're gonna go up to a diamond probably, but like the diamond. Oh, no. Mookie Betts, the best the MVP, guys. A hundred and ten k. He's gonna go up. Like, look at okay, and look. I'm gonna show you some price. Like, look. The prices are shaky. Like three Scherzer cards, like five Scherzer cards, he's up to fifty k. You have to realize that all these prices are shaky as hell. I'm going to show you, for instance. Look, his prices are shaky. Five cards, he's at 70k, then 155. Like, there's not a lot of cards posted. Not a lot of card. Not a lot of people are buying these cards. There's not a lot posted. Like, really, Kershaw for that cheap. No, there's no way he's going to stay that price. He's going to go up. Please sell now on him. Snipe him out for 23. Even if you don't make profit now, you're gonna you're gonna have to wait, guys. The, these diamond cards are way too cheap. It's it's way too cheap. It just doesn't make sense to me. They're 100 percent gonna go up. The easiest way to use the auction, guys. It just keep just just keep your sell now. Keep your sell nows on stuff. All that nonsense. Um, what else? Wait, what else can I say? Uh, hold up. We got. Let's see, Barry Larkin, we got over here, so 19k, 19k, that's cheap, like, his price is shaky, right, he goes 2, and then right up to 25, and to 26, and to 27, price is very shaky, if you won, you can put a sell now on him, his vision's crazy, speed's great, contact great, great player overall, 87 overall diamond, so 87 overall diamond for 19k is a snag, and watch, because, ready, look at this 87 overall Lindor, he's 48k right now. What makes you think he's going to stay at that price? I don't think so because ready? I'm going to show you why they're not going to stay at that price, okay? So I'm going to go over to my inventory. I'm going to go to player collection. And I'm going to show you what I'm talking about, okay? For all the starters and stuff. Okay, so ready? There's collections, right? You receive rewards in these collections, okay? My player collection, I don't know how to look at the reward. Oh, okay, there we go. For this collection, for the Orioles collection, you get 82 scoop, okay? I'm going to show you better collection. Let's see. Let's go to Red Sox. Red Sox. Okay, ready? Better collection. Look. For the Red Sox collection, I'm pretty sure you get... I'm... You might get Cy Young. You get one of these cards, but anyways, you get one of these stud cards. Hold up. There's one... Oh, this one. Yes, okay, this one. You get one of these diamonds, okay? It's not Lou Gehrig, it's not this. I'm pretty sure you get Don Mattingly. I'm not sure. But you get one of these diamond cards. And to do this whole collection, is it, it's it's way too cheap. If you remember in all the past MLBs, all the past MLBs, guys, they're so, like, it's so different. Like, everyone, in the, I remember last year in the beginning of the game, as you in the beginning of the game, every single time, everyone would sell their cards. I would get, I would just sell their my cards and panic, but you shouldn't because they're gonna go up. I guarantee it. What you wanna do for starters and stuff? Keep all your cards for now, unless they're gold or silver. Just sell your cards and just keep sniping on the auctions. Like you guys have to listen to me. It's the best way, the most finesse way. I'm telling you guys, listen to your boy Bugs. Keep grinding. Honestly, for starters too, if you guys have like. If you guys want to get a collection done and get some extra players, do a collection that's super cheap. Like, I don't know. Let me think. Uh, do... Hold up. My computer's being bogus. Do, I would say... Hmm, the Royals collection is not bad. You get... I'm pretty sure you get George Brett. Not terrible. Very good contact error. Very good vision. You're probably going to get on base a lot. You can do a Twins collection. I'm pretty sure you get Dozier. I'm not sure. Don't take my word. I'm not sure. You got one of these diamonds, I'm pretty sure. So let's check let's just check Nelson Cruz's price. So for golds, this car this card's not good. You don't want to put a sell now on it. You won't make mads. Eddie Rosario. You won't make mads in this car either. But guys, uh let me think. Cody Allen. Oh my god, Otani's such a good budget card. Let's see. So, ready, guys. Okay, so, I'm going to show you. Let's go. Okay, so, how to make mad stubs early on. How to make insane amount of stubs. So, ready, Altuve. Let's look. 
Oh my god, yo, the prices are so bad right now. I'm gonna get out of this collection. Oh my god, guys. Prices are terrible. So guys, what you want to do to make mad stubs is you just want to sit in this. You want to sit in here all day. You just want to camp. You just want to camp, look for the cell now. So honestly, I'll go to equipment. So really equipment. Look, 24k. Look at the price difference. Yeah, it's kind of risky, but it's it's worth it. I've done it mad times. I'm telling you, make mad stubs this way. We got the cleats. That's way too much. It's not selling for 70k. I doubt it. You got the bat. Woo! For 25k, you could make a quick 5k right there. So guys, you just want to keep keep searching, guys. This glove, 5k difference, should make quick 3k. It, like, I'm telling you, it's going to work. I hope you guys enjoyed the video for starters and tips. I hope you guys really enjoyed the video. It's all about stub making methods and all that stuff. I hope you guys enjoy. After this video, I'm going to be posting a budget, the, my top budget cards in the MLB The Show right now for all you beginners and stars to get. So stay tuned. Be sure to like and subscribe. Your boys post some fire content every single day. Peace out, everyone.